Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will walk you through how to check size of your model. Now, to do that, open your Power BI report. Uh, for this opportunity, I will use my IT Service Desk Performance Dashboard. Now, navigate to Top Ribbon and select External Tools. And here, uh, you should have DAX Studio. Select DAX Studio, a new window will pop up. First thing we need to do is to check if DAX Studio is loaded our model and we can check that on the left side as you can see currently is showing data for animated donut chart and I have three tables within that same file so that means that DAX Studio recognized my model I want to check if that's not the case on your side select here in drop down menu model you want to evaluate and make sure that your Power BI desktop file is open now navigate to advanced menu here and below you have view metrics option select view metrics and now below new table will pop up and under vertipack analyzer you will see some statistics related to your data model so these are all tables within my model so i have ticketing calendar table and measures table and if we check cardinality we see that uh, ticketing has highest value that means it has the most distinct values now next column is total size that we want to check and it's showing us size of our model in bytes as you can see from this example my model has something less than 0 0.15 megabytes you can also check uh, same for columns in more detailed view by selecting columns and here you will get a list of all columns their size cardinality and why this is useful in case you want to reduce your model size you can go here and check column size and to evaluate do you need all those columns and which one you do not need and then you can delete certain column you don't need and by deleting it you will reduce size of your model next tab is relationships it will show you all the relationships within your model currently i have only one and you can also see size of it now let's go to summary partitions this is not so important let's go to summary and here we can see total size in memory it's 0 0.2 megabytes approximately i have total three tables and total 14 columns now if you do not have dax studio you will have to install it now just go to google and type dax studio download select first link this is the one you will recognize it by this icon select it and download latest version that's this one it's free installation is very simple just click yes when it's needed and next and you will install it once you install it you will have to restart your rbi desktop file and start it again and then you should have it under external tools here thank you for watching this video i hope you find this interesting and if that's the case don't forget to like and subscribe if you are new to this channel bye